Don't know why she got me feeling this way She's got a way about her She's got a way about her My mesmerized like every night Hi guys! Oh my god, hi guys! Welcome back to my channel my name is Sonia Ogon. If you're here for the first time, hi, welcome to this space. Welcome to my channel. Uh, I'm for my returning subscribers. Hi, guys. I have missed you guys so, so much. Like, it's been how long since I actually helped my camera to actually do this? Now, I posted in my last video that I was going to leave YouTube. I was contemplating on leaving YouTube and the rest. And I got, like, you know, a few of you commented and were like, don't leave and all of that 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 was actually nice that that, that was sweet it actually made me feel it felt good yeah okay guys so i'm going to be this vlog is going to be today's video slash vlog is going to be like when i'm going to work and most importantly for those of you that want to relocate to abuja this vlog is going to be for you i'm going to tell you everything like before you come here <laughs> Actually, doctors, doctors I want to be looking to Abuja. This vlog is actually for you. Okay, guys, so I just got to work now. I'm like, I think 10 minutes early because I had to leave the house early to drop off my nephew because I drop him off uh, sometimes at school. So I had to go drop him off. So because of that, I had to leave the house earlier than normal. But for some reason, there was no hold up. So which is making me get to work, you know, like really, really early. So that is it let me just get in settle down and then we're going to start chit chatting okay so guys um keep watching and it's so nice to actually be here doing this again guys welcome back to the second part of this video now the time right now is about 10 30 ish i ever since i came in i was trying to see a couple of patients do rounds do post rounds and all of that see our patients so right now i'm a little bit settled down so let's get to the other part of this video which i stated i was going to tell you guys about like for people that want to, doctors that want to come to Abuja like the things you need to know okay yeah. so I'm gonna tell you guys about my experience so that you would actually know so I came to Abuja July last year so it's almost getting to a year now since I came to I relocated to Abuja I finished NYC and I said you know what let's move to Abuja I also thought of moving to Lagos but I don't like Lagos I don't think I would survive in Lagos the lifestyle is too rugged for me and I don't think I would want to spend hours in traffic and all of that so that just immediately ruled Lagos out however there are a lot of job opportunities in Lagos with very good pay especially for doctors so I'm speaking particularly for doctors in this video so it was really it was enticing it was inviting but I don't think I'll be able to survive in Lagos so I just I ruled that out I'm sorry where would I even stay so I decided to move to Abuja. Why did I choose Abuja? Now, I graduated from school 2019. I studied in Russia. So when I came back to Nigeria, I had to prepare for my MDCN exams. So I registered for a tutorial that was based in Abuja. So Abuja was like a very good transition for me. The roads were, you know, the roads are nice. The traffic is less. The lights is actually good. And I was very comfortable staying here in Abuja, which was why I said, 
I wanted to come back here, right? I liked the place and I felt like it would still give me that comfortable baby girl kind of lifestyle and I still go about my business. Do you get so with all of that I was like, let me move to Abuja. I asked a couple of friends, they were like, There are job opportunities here, come to Abuja. So when I moved to Abuja, that was in july i needed cash at the time because i had spent a lot mo moving from nyc to calabar packing my things coming here so i had spent a lot of money so i needed cash at the time so I, at that time i was like any job i see i was going to take it regardless of the pay i just needed to have cash in my account right so i started this job the pay wasn't great but i was like <laughs> It was better than what I was collecting in NYC. And I would like to say I wasn't really, I didn't really have an idea, a very good idea of how much I should be collecting as a doctor. You get. Now, let's come back to this video. Now, when I started um, going through online, I started joining so many groups on Telegram and on WhatsApp. I got to realize that there are different places in Nigeria that pay doctors better right now doctors in nigeria they normally don't get reasonable amount of money to get but there are places that are actually collecting better and i got to realize that abuja was worse you get like abuja the one thing you need to know before coming here it's comfortable right it's good but the pay for doctors in abuja is really really it's 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 bad it's not encouraging at all like you see doctors pricing negotiating eighty thousand naira for you i'm not kidding eighty thousand naira seventy thousand naira and the hours that you're working are actually long hours sometimes you see they might tell you that because you're doing only weekends in a month let them give you sixty thousand naira. you get ridiculous ridiculous prices so after i left my first job um i was collecting not so much <laughs> i even feel embarrassed even telling you guys how much i was collecting so i was collecting about 113 at the time yes so at that time it was okay for me to get i was okay with it but i needed more money get i needed more money so i had to leave that job right now i got to realize that if you want to get a better job in this abuja let's say they want to pay about 230 280 best believe that you will work for that money but like you will see your house like you're you'll be visiting your house and you'll be living in the hospital that all these things i got to realize that I was like but when you see adverts in other places you are seeing like um you're seeing job schedules like monday to friday 8 to 5 pm no weekends and you're collecting something like 300 there are hospitals like that out of abuja but in this abuja if you're going to collect anything other than from 200 and above best believe that you at least do two weekends in a month you work eight to five or you do some night shifts and the places are very 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 busy so now there was a group i think the m1 I'm not so sure, but NMA Abuja, they had to do a lot, a little bit of review, and they were like, you're not going to collect uh, um, for covers, nothing less than 1K per hour. Like, not, the minimum should be 1K per hour. So doctors here are trying to uphold to it, so that at least Abuja will have a better pay for doctors, because normally, right, right now, as I speak to you, it's not good at all. So. I asked a couple of friends they should give me their opinions if uh, a doctor wants to come to abuja what advice would they want would they give to the doctor and all of them were just saying don't come don't do it don't come don't come don't come honestly speaking there are better places out there it's just like the reason why i came here is that i like the comfort you get i like there's everything in abuja i think so i'm accessible to so many things like it was just a best bet for me but for you you need to weigh your options right you need to weigh your options are you looking for the comfort or are you looking for words that you know if you should come to abuja or not so there are other places just check well so another point i want to talk about is um expense abuja is very expensive i would like everybody to actually know that before you come in a place is not cheap 
so um accommodation is on the expensive side now if you want to stay like in town oh my god you're thinking of 500k you're thinking of six seven like, all this my time key that's how much you should be thinking of spending on accommodation right but guarimpa because i asked a couple of people around guarimpa is around like 300 you can get for 300 to 50 i might be wrong i stand corrected i just asked and i was told but i haven't spoken to any uh real estate um agent that to tell me the particular price so imagine having to pay all that money for accommodation and your bills and food and everything and you're collecting 150 honestly speaking there are places where they pay you 150 150 k a month in this temperature 80,000 naira. how are you going to survive how is that how, how how it's not possible or you're collecting 200 250 it's not really it's not encouraging and you're working long long hours now food in abuja is not too expensive i don't think food in abuja is really really expensive like um there are certain markets that you can go to and you can actually get affordable um foodstuffs at an, at an affordable prices so that is just it so in summary i would just want to advise anybody that's coming here to be re to just have it at the back of your mind that they don't pay doctors well here they do not pay doctors well here and if you should actually see a place that they will pay you well you are going to work for it <laughs> you'll be visiting your house and be living in the hospital i have just four days off in a month I can't even tell you how much I'm collecting. It's actually embarrassing <laughs> because, um, however, the proximity from where I work to my house is really, really close. So I'm not complaining. I don't have to spend too much on fuel. I don't have to really spend too much on a lot of things. So I'm just using that as a compensation for myself to say, okay, this, this is okay for me. And the workload is not so heavy right like it's heavy but i'm able to sit down and make a video like this what's come to us the patient comes they send it to me i see the patient and i don't know you should understand what i'm trying to say but there are places where like the the last place i was the last place i was working i kid you not that when i go to work at eight o'clock i cannot hold my phone till 5 30 that i am actually leaving sometimes i leave by six o'clock now i had to leave that job because I was like, uh -uh, this is this is this is not it. This is not what I came to this world to come and do to come and die like this. When I go to work and I sit down, I don't stand up till okay. They give you one hour break, but the the workload was just too much. I couldn't even pick calls. I couldn't do certain things. It was a lot. So I just for my own sanity, I had to leave. So guys, um let me just <laughs> leave this here if you want to come to abuja just be rest assured that a lot of things you should put into consideration especially for doctors the pay is not so great here however you will actually see a job but it is not amazing and the housing is expensive so you have to weigh your options before you actually come here if you actually like this video please do not forget to subscribe to my youtube channel let me know what you actually think do you want to move to abuja if you're a doctor working in abuja let me know in the comment section below what do you think like doctors in abuja and everything what do you think and if you're thinking of coming to abuja <laughs> also let me know what do you think do you see what to come to abuja or not you know just let me know in the comment section below so uh so that's it guys i'll see you guys in my next video bye